staying woke uh the awakening being woke um not sleeping i've heard so many i guess you can say phrases for this thing that we call staying woke um to me there are so many definitions to being woke the awakening um spirituality and all of that but at the end of the day what has really resonated with me when it comes to staying woke is learning the difference between religion um, and tradition the difference between uh, spirituality uh, and religion the difference between what what's in all of these books whether it is uh, the Bible the Quran um, the different faiths I have come to a realization that at the end of the day, what we are supposed to do is keep one commandment, and that is the commandment to love, um, to share love, to be love, um, and to be that walking on the earth. When I think about staying woke, I also envision um, that people will know the difference between spiritual or religion cults. Um, that control people, control their minds, control their creativity, control their existence, control their being, control their um, thought process just, just to be able to challenge different things. So being woke, my people, is not necessarily that um, you have this huge, you know, this huge... Um, I don't know, come to Jesus, if you will. Being woke is knowing the difference between what was being taught and what you have learned. What was being taught and what you know that works for you. What you have been taught and what you have learned along the way. The awakening, staying woke, being woke simply means doing what you know to do that is best for you at this moment without all of this religious uh control crap jargon um fallacies if you will being thrown at you being woke simply means just that being woke being conscious to know that everything that you were taught as a child may not necessarily be truth may not necessarily be what works for you may not necessarily be the way that you need to go but be able to stand in your truth and be woke.